subscribe to the channel. We have daily videos with the latest news from the arsenal and, to make sure you don't miss anything, turn on the notification bell. Arsenal, very interested in signing Martin Zubimendi. Having demonstrated his qualities at his boyhood club in recent years, the 25-year-old has attracted a lot of attention from several big clubs in Europe. Bayern Munich have already expressed an interest in him, but it was suggested that the Bavarian club were looking at him as Xavi Alonso was willing to sign him. However, after failing to appoint the Spaniard as their new manager and deciding to sign Vincent Kompany to succeed Thomas Tuchel, they have apparently cooled their interest in signing him. Arsenal are planning to acquire a new midfielder to play alongside Declan Rice and are very interested in Zubimendi. Mikel Arteta is a great admirer of the Spaniard, so the North London club could opt to make a concrete approach to buying him. Zubimendi has a £50 million release clause in his current contract, so Arsenal will have to spend a considerable amount of money for him. However, the article states that the Spanish international has not expressed a desire to leave his boyhood club, so Arsenal will have to convince the midfielder to move to the Emirates Stadium. With Thomas Partey's future currently uncertain Mohamed Elneny set to leave the club as a free agent this summer, signing a new midfielder would be the right move. Pause this news, just to say that if you want YouTube to continue recommending the latest news from the Arsenal for you, then it is very important that you already leave a like on this video. It cost. Let's continue with the news. Arsenal have already been linked with a plethora of names, with Bruno Guimaraes, Douglas Luiz and Amadou Onana among them, but Zubimendi is also on their radar. The Real Sociedad star is a technically gifted player and has the necessary qualities to play in Mikel Arteta's system. The Spaniard has flourished under Emmanuel Alguacil, who also uses a similar style to Arteta. Therefore, Zubimendi would be a huge coup for Arsenal if they bought him. However, it will be interesting to see if the North London club are able to secure his signature in the next transfer window to bolster their engine room. Former Arsenal star Bakary Sagna has encouraged the club to sign Manchester United striker Marcus Rashford. Arsenal have been linked with a striker who could play on the wing in recent months. They are eager to add electric pace along their front line and cover for Bukayo Saka, although Rashford plays more often on the left which is occupied by Gabriel Martinelli and Leandro Trossard. Rashford is apparently not happy at Man United under Eric Ten Hag and there has been much speculation in the media that he is a player the board would allow to leave at the end of the season if the right transfer offer was made. Sagna believes the Gunners must test United's resolve for the two-time FA Cup winners this summer. I would love to see Marcus Rashford at Arsenal. I think if you added Rashford to Arsenal's attack, with the pace he has, Arsenal would destroy the opponent, said the former Arsenal, Manchester City and France fullback. Adding Rashford to an extremely talented squad would be a daunting prospect for Arsenal's rivals. Rashford is so fast. I think Arsenal with Rashford would allow Arsenal to have more variety in attack and I would love to see Gabriel Jesus and Marcus Rashford in the same team, pressing with such intensity. It would be a brilliant capture and I think there is room in the squad for a player of Rashford's ability because Gabriel Jesus won't be able to play every game and Kai Havertz can also play multiple roles. Rashford joining Arsenal would be a wonderful signing for the club and a real statement of ambition. Last season, Arsenal came dangerously close to winning the Premier League. Mikel Arteta now needs to improve his team. The transfer window is about to begin, Domestic transfers begin on June 14th and international transfers begin on July 1st. The Gunners will re-enter the market when that happens. Last summer's arrivals improved Arsenal. The signing of Declan Rice was notable despite the high cost. The whole team won and that was evident on the field. Arsenal will likely be in contention for the championship again next season, provided Arteta can keep his team injury-free. Having been so close, the motivation will be strong. The Arsenal team showed excellent cohesion, now they just need a few key additions to win. Players who can easily fit in and add a new dimension to the squad will need to be identified by Edu and the recruitment team. Arsenal are reportedly interested in Girona winger Viktor Tsigankov. Tsigankov, 26, 
was instrumental in Girona's historic Champions League qualification. In 2023-2024 he scored 8 goals and 7 assists. Arsenal noticed him because of his performances, and he could only cost 30 million euros. Girona will not want to part ways with Tsigankov with European football just around the corner. They will have to take this into consideration, however, if a good offer comes along. Although he is willing to listen if Girona make an offer, Tsigankov personally does not want to upset things there. Girona will not want to part ways with Tsigankov with European football just around the corner. They will have to take this into consideration, however, if a good offer comes along. Although he is willing to listen if Girona make an offer, Tsigankov personally does not want to upset things there. Goncalo Inacio is the Portuguese defender that Manchester United are looking for. He is seen by them as an essential acquisition to strengthen their defence. Sporting CP player Inácio has been praised for his efforts since joining the club's first team. He is only 22 years old and is already an important member of his squad and the Portuguese national team. In 2023-2024, United struggled defensively. They are eager to bolster their defense as injuries to key players have left them exposed. With Johnny Evans' future uncertain and Rafael Varane leaving, they need new blood to ensure stability. For them, Goncalo Inácio is ideal. Furthermore, not everyone was blind to Inácio's rise at Sporting CP. Several elite clubs in Europe have shown interest in his strong achievements. Wanting to remain competitive, Manchester United have been keeping an eye on him for some time. He could be a long-term benefit to the team, they think. The first steps have already been taken by the Red Devils to investigate the possibility of bringing Inacio to Old Trafford. Now they are preparing to present a formal offer. The provision for the release of 60 million euros from Inacio's contract with Sporting CP is known to him. While United intends to negotiate and perhaps reduce the cost, they are ready to meet the provision if necessary. And now Arsenal fan, I want to hear from you. What is your opinion about this? Put your opinion in the comments, I don't know if you know, but your opinion is very important for Arsenal I'll be back with another news from Arsenal at any moment.